I could so PR this for you. Make sure that you're seen with a really cool guy. Um, a Justin Bieber looking like well, him. Don't talk daft. She doesn't need any PR. Everybody at that wedding thinks I have a lesbian sister. How is this now about you? you pass us that butter, Sam. Claire Peacock has never got over the house swap. She's not mentally ill. She's not semi detached either, that's her problem. <laughs> Making nasty accusations because she's jealous. Lesbian, my eye. It's called friendship. Not that hers are queuing round the block. There are no dungarees in this house, thank you very much. <laughs> I'm sorry about before. I thought you'd want me to keep my big gulp shut. Yeah, definitely. You have them, Mum. Nasty accusations. Like being gay is disgusting. You're 15. You don't know what you are. Dad, I am in love with a girl, okay? And you're the one that's confused about that, not me. Okay, I might say the wrong thing. I'm just your clumsy old dad, and I'm not very, uh, PC. Just don't call me confused, okay? It's really insulting. Okay. And Shan's not confused either. She's just bricking it in case her dad finds out. And was you bricking about telling me? Yeah. I suppose I just didn't want you to be disappointed in me. That never happened. Yeah. You say that, don't you, but deep down. You're 15. You know. It could be a phase, it could fizzle out. You wish. Have you never thought about kissing Tyrone or Ashley? <laughs> no. <laughs> Why? Have you? No. But Dad, you know you're straight, okay? I know I'm not. Come here. I don't want Mum to know, though. You won't arrest her, her. No, Dad. Because you know what she's like, and she'll get mad, and she'll stop me from seeing Sean. Oh, she'll be really hurt that you didn't no, trust her. No, Dad, you can't tell her because if okay, you tell her. Okay. You know what the doctor said? He told her not to get stressed out, and this will really stress her out. Hey. And on that, you've never disappointed me. You wouldn't know how to. I respect you, and I'll support you always. Will you be happy for me? I'll get there. <laughs> oh, don't worry, I'm not going to kiss you. Is it me or are people looking at us funny? Is she you? Have you been crying? Yeah, why aren't you? Only when I'm awake. Look, I told my dad it's true. You never. Sophie! I needed to. Yeah, well, I need to just keep your gob shut. I'm sorry. We said we'd deny it. Shiny's my dad. I wanted to. I can't believe you've done this to me. And you didn't freak out. He said he still loves me, and how yeah, I made up for yourself. He wants me to tell my mum. Oh, why don't we hire the town hall out, eh, and make a big announcement about it? I know we'll end up telling her. And when he does, I know she won't let me see you again. Then you can visit my grave, can't you, after my dad's murdered me? I believe the cat's out the bag, girls. Congratulations. This place is like a goldfish bowl. It's just gonna get worse and worse. I can't not see you. Same. Let me just get off, yeah? Disappear. What do you mean, like, run away? It's the only way we can stay together. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> Believe it. I've not been more for once today. <sighs> Where are you skulking off to? Uh, please tell me you're not running away. You've got it in one. <sighs> Sophie, 
Yeah, I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to tough it out. Us people are gonna think it's true. It is true, okay? It's true. I'm in love with Shan, and if I stick around here any longer, Rosie, people are gonna try and split us up. Especially my mum. Please, it's all fair. I would never have said that if I'd have known. Because <laughs> apparently I need a PR strategy. Because I've been called the worst thing in the world. <gasps> Sophie, <laughs> I'm a stupid cow and you know that. <laughs> you know. <sighs> Sophie, I wish I was a candidate you feel you could talk to. Yeah, who you are now. <laughs> right, um. It's all I've got. Thank you. <laughs> Tell mum and dad not to worry, okay? I'll be fine. <laughs> I've got to go. <laughs> be careful, yeah? <laughs> one sleeping bag and one large chocolate bag. Well, I've got four oil galas, two tangerines, and two cans of lemonade. Solid. <laughs> Nuts. Nuts. Mm. So, um, I was thinking Scarpa, maybe. But the lesbian capital of your No, there's bar jobs and waitressing jobs. I mean, how much money have you got? £23. How much you give it, man? She knows you've liked it. She knows everything, and before you start kicking off, she was so supportive. She even emptied out a purse for us. I wish I had a sister. <laughs> I can share mine. She's a mare. Sophie? Sophie? Has Sophie gone out? You could say that. Mum, she left you this. Oh, Gary, we're too late. Oh, come on, Mum, don't cry. They're gonna be all right. Where have they gone? I don't know. Dad, I really don't know. When did she go? Well, about an hour ago. She went to see Sean and she was dead happy. Oh, she'd rather sleep on the streets than stop here. We've got to find her, Kevin. We've got to find her. 